Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. After entering purchases through the Purchases Receive Inventory window, you can select Tasks, Select for Payment from the menu bar to use the Select for Payment window to pay multiple vendor bills. When you select this option, the Select for Payment Filter Selection window appears. You use this window to select the invoice and vendor filter criteria used to select the invoices to pay. In the Select for Payment Filter Selection window, enter the date for the payment checks into the Check Date field. To filter for invoices due before a certain date, type that date into the Invoices Due Before field. To filter for invoices by the date a discount is lost, enter the Discount Date into the Or Discounts Lost By field. You can set additional filter criteria in the Include Invoices section. You can set it to include all invoices or only invoices. If you select the Only Invoices option button, you must enter the number of days past due with balances over whatever dollar amount you then enter. You could also filter by vendor and select either all vendors or vendors that are from a certain point in the vendor list to another point in the vendor list. If you do this, you must select the vendor IDs in the From and To fields. You could also select only vendors that match a specific vendor type by entering that vendor type into the Type Mask field. To always calculate and take invoice discounts even if the due date has passed, check the Always Take Discounts Regardless of Due Date checkbox. When finished, click OK to open the Select for Payment window. This window shows the bills you've entered that match the selection criteria you set. It shows all outstanding invoices, credit memos, and prepayments that match the filtering criteria. It also automatically selects all entries for payment. Click the Pay checkbox for any invoice you don't want to pay, as each bill is marked as paid by default. To mark all the entries to be paid or unpaid, click the Check All or Clear All buttons in the toolbar at the top of the window. If needed, you can change the cash account used to pay these invoices within the Cash Account field at the top of the Select for Payment window that appears. To make partial payments on an invoice, enter the partial amount in the Pay Amount column for the desired invoice. Also, each vendor is issued a single check, no matter how many invoices are being paid. After selecting the invoices to pay, make sure the information at the top of this window is correct. To then print the checks, click the Print button in the Windows toolbar to print the checks to the selected vendors. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.